Introducing the new Heritage series from the start. Our heritage, your legacy. Okay, we'll start with a mustard alpha point. This is a uh, curved caddis barbless, size 16. I have sheer grey. 40 naught. So we've just attached this. This is a excellent emerging caddis, but it also works very well on uh, midges if it's tied in smaller sizes. Just remove that. And what we want to do is just flatten my thread by spinning it anti clockwise. And then go down into the bend. We want to make a little sunken body here. Keep your thread flat. Like this. And then when we come down into the bottom, I want to spin my thread clockwise to give it a round profile just so I can put a little rib on that rear section just like that and then we stop here then what I need is this is UV enhancer grey this is a lovely shuck material and all we need is one strand because one strand is actually three strands so I just pinch that in there like so and go up to secure it. Then we fold this over so we actually double the three strands into six strands and then we can go back to keep this above the submerged body like that and then we just want to make it about that long that's perfect then I want to spin my time thread anti-clockwise again to give it a flat profile how are we doing there that's perfect and then I'll just split that like so. I'll apply a little wax just to the top position. And I've just made a new batch of hairs here. Then I'll put some hairs here in this hand. I'll pull out a little, slide it up. And then a little more, slide that up between the loop, close the loop, and then I can just distribute this as I wish to have it. I don't need much here. And then I'll spin my tying thread clockwise to make a very spiky hazier dubbing brush. Like so. Let's get that long one out. Perfect. And then we'll come back, fold that over, pull that hazier back as we go forward. Like so. Very simple pattern. But as I said, very effective. And I have three tiny CDC hackles that I've aligned the tips up. Just to put a little bit of wax on my tying thread there. Just like that. And lift up the front and 
take our whip finisher and this thread is waxed so I don't need to varnish it, there's no point varnishing such a small fly the wax will hold the whip finish just like that draw that in excellent we'll take our scissors and just remove that and what we want is a tiny little head like we would on an LK Cavis just like that bit of wax there we go and that's the Cadiz Emerger but as I said it works wonderful in smaller sizes 18 and 20s for midges if you enjoy the videos please like share subscribe and as always thanks for watching